Hey folks, welcome back to Pickle Slabs Gaming. We are playing God of War Ragnarok, and when we last left off, we are back with Freya. Um, and we're kind of searching, we're searching for the fates, and we got into a big battle here. Um, and that was a little fun. Um, a little strenuous. We didn't really have an issue, but it was just, you know, some things can be annoying. Um, but we are kind of looking for Atreus because he's in um, Asgard, uh, but we're not super... Or we assume we're, he's in Asgard, but we don't actually know. Um, well, okay, Kratos doesn't know. I know he's in Asgard because we played as him, but they don't know that. But... We will continue on. I'm still super stressed out about the Atreus Odin situation. I think Odin's just being super manipulative and will eventually be the demise of Atreus, possibly. Or at least Kratos. So, should be interesting. Anyone ever tell you that you babble when you're terrified? Terrified? I'll have you know I'm at the very most deeply apprehensive. <laughs> and making tension with humor is the sacred duty of a traveling companion. I how very dare you! Babbling. Well, you are babbling. Uh oh. Oh, that was official. Oh please, we've seen these seals before. Don't be ridiculous. But usually when we see these seals it means we're fighting a Valkyrie. So, I hope I no longer am right about that. Uh oh. Whoa, 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 whoa. Where are we? Oh my goodness. Freya, now is not the time. Uh, luckily, these are all like cutting butter. It's a hot knife. That's handy. Kind of stressful. Does that mean that we're gonna have a uh, Atreus situation on our hands here? Oh boy, okay, they're really, really sending us through the uh, psychological, um, oh boy, really sending us on the mission here. Just a revenant. Yeah, oh, I'm aware. Oh my goodness, Sigrun. Whoa. You do 
is not her. Yeah, I was about to say. Of course. I mean, we gotta, we gotta settle down. We're just gonna rip his head off. Oh, 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 what? Why didn't you trust your own son? So let him take me. This, this is stressful. I'm scared. Why won't you see him the way he wants to be seen? Get out of here. Yeah, <laughs> loser. Gotcha. Oh boy. Oh, definitely shouldn't have got that. That one was good. Down, good grief. Toy with us still. Well, this is rough. What is that? A kelpie. Don't see many of those in these parts. I left. Will she take us to them? I left my axe in the uh, in the other world. Oh, a water horse. Can I have my axe back now? You have to talk about whatever the norms put you through. No. <laughs> Get on. That's a good lass. Lovely creatures, but temperamental by reputation. In my land, they keep children away from the lost by telling them a Kelpie would drown them. Of course, no Kelpie I know would do such a thing. Oh. Horse that walks on water. Aye. No mystical water steeds to speak of in Greece, brother. Mm. There were the hippocamps. They served the sea god. I battled one upon a titan. <laughs> that might not be her favorite subject. Uh oh. Hold your breath. Please have my axe back. I'm just not allowed to pull my weapon at all. Okay, fine. Nemo? Are you in here? Find some weird people in here. Kratos speaks first. I seek my son. <laughs> you know the child is an Asgard. No, you see what all who search for us seek to know the ending to your story. The ghost of Sparta furrows his brow menacingly. <laughs> he resists the urge to grunt. <laughs> oh, he fails. <laughs> you come to I like these people. Hideous archetypes, seeking freedom from your scripts. As if knowing your lines would grant you the power to rewrite them. Speak, Speak plain. 
You will die, Kratos of Sparta. Yikes. But you called him the destroyer of fate. There must be a way to subvert destiny. There is no destiny, Puck. Oh, it's Puck. That's fun. There is no grand design, no script. Only the choices you make. That your choices are so predictable. Merely make us seem prescient. When my son was born, shut up! <laughs> your prophecy said he would die a needless death, and he did. Because you could not let him go. Because he thirsted for revenge. And because you kill gods. But what Kratos did, it was not out of hate. Should I bring him a crown then? He still slays gods, but now he's sad about it? You are the sum of your choices, nothing more. And because your choices never change, you will learn that Heimdall intends to kill your son in Asgard, and you will do what you do best. And then Ragnarok. The skies burn, the curtains fall. Exunt omni. Heimdall. <laughs> Again, he misses the point. Focusing on the second act to the exclusion of the final. A common mistake in Storycraft. We are, we are leaving. leaving. He stomps away, followed closely by Freya. I enjoyed your story, Kratos. Pity it has to end so soon. <laughs> Well, that was educational. To say the least. My goodness. Alright, back on the hippogriff. Let us leave this place. Happily. Things getting more normal already. Wait, that tree. Well, isn't that interesting? What is this? That's the noose, brother. The one Odin hanged himself with, as part of his endless mad quest for secrets of life and death and what have you. What are you doing? It's a charged object, significant to Odin. Perhaps I'll find a use for it. Brother, what they said about the boy... ...will not happen. Oh, I agree. It will not happen. We will not let it. Of course we bloody won't. The question is how? You wouldn't seriously consider killing Heimdall, would you? I will do what I must. Oh, is that all? You're wrong to dissuade him, Amir. You know Heimdall. I grant you that he's a spiteful, vicious little shit. And so loyal, Odin entrusted him with Galahorn. If we have the chance to eliminate him before Ragnarok, we shouldn't hesitate. Considering his powers of foresight alone, that is an if of mountainous size. Oh boy, so we might fight Heim Heimdall? That's gonna be a little crazy. Because yes, Atreus is not super strong, but Heimdall is also incredibly strong. Ooh, a chest. Thank you. Very much. Uh, anything over there? Oh, another chest in the distance. Seems like an easy one. Come from over here? Yes, okay. 
Sorry, sorry, sorry. Backtracking. Okie dokie. Let us climb the wall. Even supposing we're all perfectly comfortable plotting an assassination, and I, for one, am a mite rusty at that measure, we've got no way to reach Heimdall. And no way to kill him if we did. I have killed gods greater than him. I don't doubt that, brother. But it's hardly my point. <laughs> You're gonna go on a uh, god killing spree or something, Kratos? Could be fun. Kratos, I see something. Or do you now? Oh yeah. There we go. Um, okay, this looks like the alternate. Well, we're, obviously I'm exploring Freya, so back off. Oh, we've been here. Uh, let us go after getting the hex over, please. There we go. Cool. All right, let's get out of here. Place sucks. I think we're missing the known's message here. We've all got our tendencies, and yours is to run headlong into danger to protect the ones you love. I do not intend to change. Not about that. Why should you? Apparently, my tendency is to kill the ones I love. Freya. I don't need you to comfort me. Either of you. Their accusation was cruel. None of us believe. The truth can be a cruel thing. Anyone care to argue with that? No, but Baldur's fate had many causes, prophecy among them. What do you mean, brother? There are many tales in my homeland of those who fulfilled prophecy by attempting to avoid it. So it was when Freya tried to protect Baldur, and so it was when I accused my son of going to Asgard. Mm. It would be foolish to go after Heimdall. No, no. If Heimdall must die for Atreus to live, then Heimdall must die. How can you say that, knowing what you know? Because if Heimdall is a threat to my son, I must act. It is my Your nature. Well played, Norms. <laughs> nice. Let us find a gateway. Return home. Consider our plans. Hold R1. Or X to drift. Whoa! You make any hasty drifting! Drifting! Whoa! 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 Give your mind a little time to process everything. I suspect there's unfinished business here at the lake. Though, I'm certainly happy. Nova has a lot of thoughts right now. It's your choice, brother. We are going to. How can I help? See if we have any upgrades. Oh, we do. We have a Chaos Flame. Where'd that come from? Hmm. I don't remember getting that. Um, and then a Ronda of Deflection. Increase the timing window on parries. Okay. I actually like that idea. Their deaths will be painless. Let's go ahead and upgrade. Ah, oh, we can't upgrade. Okay. Cool. All right, fair enough. Yeah, it's still going to be super... If we just keep on upgrading this, I think that'll be good. Except it's hard to get dwar Dwarven Steel, so... We won't be able to upgrade all of them in the same... Take care of your armor, and it'll take care of you. Do, do, do... Alright, back home we go. Well, not home, Sentry's house. Now tell me of this power Heimdall wields. He sees the future. More like he reads the person, sees their intention. My intent will be to kill him. Knowing that will be no advantage. 
Brother, this is no one to underestimate. Any move you make, you'll have seen it coming. If you must face him, we need something else. An edge. Humor me? Very well. We will ask the dwarves. Ah, the inevitable asking of the dwarves. Classic. Excuse me, sir. Could I have a moment of your time? Sure, Red Ataskar. Uh, side mission. Sorry, bud. We're not gonna hang with you. Let's talk. I have news. Oh. Did the Norns tell you how to get Atreus back? Do we have a plan? The Norns say Atreus will be killed by Heimdall. The plan is to kill Heimdall first. Oh, wow. Okay, Heimdall. Let's see. Never loses. Sees everything coming. Unpopular at parties. This won't be easy. Whatever his advantages, I will overwhelm him with my own. That's the idea. You gotta overpopulate his senses, see? And I got just the thing in mind to help you do it. Perfect. Sinjin, go get drop here. Drop here? But we need it. Our supplies. Oh, we got plenty. And to spare. Even if we did, drop here's no weapon. Why would a... Oh. You mean we combine it with... That's right. And then when he... It'll go... Damn you, that's brilliant. Very well. Is this when we get the, uh... Go fetch Dropnir. I did have one thing spoiled for me. No hate. But I did have one thing spoiled, and this might be it? Maybe? I bloody knew these two had nicked it. And Odin blamed me for it disappearing. They stole Dropnir. We didn't steal nothing. We just ungifted what never should have been gifted in the first place. I will help me kill Heimdall. Never you mind all that. It's a fucking surprise. We're our teeth. But to even store Dropnir, you'd need... You were saying... So now you intend to kill Heimdall. Violence cannot prevent violence, Kratos. I truly thought you understood that. No matter what you thought I understood, my son is in danger. You will not allow harm to come to him. Sindri. Where are you? A dwarf's treasure trove. Kratos, I've never seen anyone so much as lay a finger on him. Not one. Well, I gathered what's fit for gathering. How long will it take? We'll have to go to Svartalfheim to get the rest of the materials. Not to mention we'll have to visit the lady. Oh. Uh, who's the lady? Ooh, that's a relief. <laughs> Kratos? 
Whenever you're ready. Oh man, I'm traveling with Sindri. Uh, he's just so awkward around Kratos. The dialogue is going to be crazy. Well. Okay, fine. You guys have any fun dialogue? I'm only just realizing all the little routines I've had to adopt taking care of Dropnir. I'll miss melting rings down for crafting gold, but I suppose we have enough to see us through to Ragnarok. <laughs> Too soon? Yep. Well, we are actually going to stop it here. It's a bit early, but I don't want to get headlong into a, another mission and cut it in half so if you've enjoyed anything uh, in this video go ahead and leak a, leave a like leak a like leave a like and comment um, with any tips or tricks and if you don't mind subscribing to the channel that will help us out greatly and we'll see you next time thanks folks